السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته. Today is Friday, twenty first of January, twenty twenty three. And I'm with Abdul Ghani, brilliant young man. Today I'm apologizing for what I have done to him four years ago in Istanbul when I was very harsh in giving my advice to him, and I felt sorry. So today we are having coffee together after four years. Actually, but he will give you a message, inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh, dear brothers and sisters. Jum'ah mubarak to you, to your souls, your families and friends. Allah Akbar. This is, you know, my uncle, my father, my mentor, my everything, Allah Akbar. Sometimes a parent has to give you, you know, a strong response so that you go further. And because of what, you know, my uncle told me that day, I've learned a lot. I, I will never forget. One of the things I said to me was that Muhammad Al-Fatih, you know, um, he said to me, when this young man conquered this city, he was 20, what, what did he say? I mean, 20 something. This, this yeah. is 20. 20, yeah. So he said to me, you can do that and much more. You know, he left me with that message and that made me grow so much. And I love him for Allah's sake. And he's my uncle, my mentor, my teacher, my everything. Uh, but actually, loving me or not, I have to apologize. I have to apologize for him. And remember that actually, sometimes you could be very harsh with the young people. Sometimes this kind of diff, يعني, hard time you give to them could break their back or could, or could make them become champion, inshallah. So be balanced when you're becoming a harsh man or woman advising the young people. What's your advice for young people? Um, my advice to young people is um, you have a very limited time in this world. What are you going to chase? Is it going to be money? Is it going to be cars, flashy cars, Ferrari, Lamborghini, BMW, whatever? Is it going to be women? Is it going to be, you know, a mansion or whatever? Or are you going to chase, you know, um, what is everlasting? Allah Ajal says, you know, um, so the akhirah, what is to come, is much better, Allah says. Khayrun wa abaqa, and everlasting, much more lasting. It's better in every way, shape or form. So, and the rent, as Muhammad Ali said, may Allah have mercy on his soul, the rent that you pay for your room in this world is your service to others. And that I learned from my dear uncle, Dr. Hani al Banab, who has created, um, you know, the largest um, Muslim organization in Western Europe. Islamic belief, um, of which you know the annual revenue is almost 200 million pounds a year. How many millions of people, how many billions of people have been supported by this? Not only that, human appeal, Muslim hands, all the other Muslim um, uh, charities and organizations, they were inspired by this. Yeah. So this is my message, the Akhirah and your service to others in this world. Jazakum Allah khair, Brother Abdul Ghani, and to all of you today, Friday, happy Friday, good Friday, Mubarak for all of us, inshallah. And please, please don't be depressed, don't let anyone on earth to put you down, don't put anyone, let anyone on earth to demoralize you, don't let anyone actually to twist your arm, focus, work, deliver, improve, connect, and empower the young people. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Jema wa barakatuh. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.